The 48th annual Nordside Special Olympics brought out some of the most energetic and happy participants to compete in track and field events. An estimated 1,500 athletes turned out for the week-long elementary, middle school, and high school level competition. Here's a look at some of the elementary students. Opening ceremonies got underway for Northside Special Olympics with a parade of participants representing their schools. Many principals joined the athletes as parents and other supporters cheered them on. There was plenty of enthusiasm in the air and in true Olympic fashion, students took turns carrying the torch in a relay and then lighting the cauldron to get the games underway. For fourth grader Emma Grace Olick, it was a day she won't soon forget. She came in first place in the girls' 50-meter dash. It was exciting, and I was kind of nervous. She kept a quick, steady pace and stayed ahead of the pack. Emma Grace is visually impaired, so accommodations were made for her to run along a guide rope. In a separate 50-meter dash, third grader Juliana Peña won her race. I did, I won the race. Just like many of her competitors, Juliana put in a lot of hard work that started back in October. That's when the students tried out their running, jumping, and throwing skills and then found out which categories were best for them. We give them time to practice and learn about how the routine goes. And then throughout the year, the year their adaptive PE specialist and Special Olympic coach works with them on those skills. Jump as far as you can jump! There were a lot of exciting moments, but Special Olympics organizers say the games are really about the children having fun. It's really not about whether they get first, second, or third place out here. They instantaneously make friends with everybody in their group and that's what you will notice the most at the finish line is them high-fiving each other and basically just introducing themselves to a whole new group of people that they don't get to see on a daily basis. It's a time for the students to not only showcase their athletic abilities but boost their confidence as well. Northside's annual Special Olympics is made possible with about 80 community volunteers and 200 Northside volunteers.